hi guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl is in the williams how are you all doing hope you guys are good hope you guys are fine if you're new to this channel kindly click on the subscription button click on the notification bell to let you know whenever i post any new video okay guys i told you i'm going to come back for part two of this whole queen you know um acting out of character if you ask me because i mean i didn't expect her to actually come out to drag maria like that seriously guys but she did and that is why we are here again so because of that thing that queen wrote everybody started having an opinion it's as if they opened a gateway for big brother niger children <laughs> all over yes guys and i'm gonna be sharing with you some of the things they put out the first person to actually put out something after queen made that statement is beatrice um she put this out on her insta story and said i'm not available for any stray bullet stop tagging me on any post that is not about love i just want to show love and be loved this 2022 second corinthians 517 thank you Mm -hmm. hey, 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 hey. Beatrice, darling, are you sure they were actually tagging you? Why were they tagging you? Okay, maybe they were tagging you because, I mean, or because of what Maria, I'm um, sorry, because of what Queen said. So for you to now, I don't know, gloat, I don't know. But then again, then again, you've already, you know, given us something in the past and we just want a continuation of that. Basically, that's it. But whichever one, Sha, thank you for telling us they have been tagging you. Then the next person to actually put out something is Sammy. Yes, Sammy from Big Brother, the one that had something to do with Angel. And at some point, I don't know what happened to their relationship and it just crashed. Well, he put this out and said, it sucks when you want to be heartless, but you know that's not who you are. Now, why did Sammy put this out? Is it in any way connected to the whole Queen versus Maria situation? We do not know, but you know Big Brother children now. They always do this. Like, when one is talking, it actually gives the others courage to come out to talk. So, even if it is connected or not connected... I be or not connected sorry i'll still talk about it the next person is tega in fact tega took it up a notch by going on live stream even though on the live stream she didn't want you know people to talk about it a lot of people were like asking her about the whole maria and queen situation and she didn't want to talk about it i'm like hmm. anyway she put this out and said this year, Manchala is Machala actually, but I don't know why she put Manchala anyway. Machala vibes, that is my worst kid. Um, but before then, how can you have a heart so dark, filled with negativity, hatred, and jealousy? This is so dirty, man. 2022, all love and vibes. Spread love on okay, spread love only their tea hearts. Who are tea hearts? Okay, her fans. Oh, okay, okay. Happy new year. Now, at first. I didn't understand like i never pinned it on the whole maria and queen situation until i saw this tweet that tega liked people of god this is a tweet by somebody and the person tagged queen and said their queen um matang that is her name on twitter we all know how much ubi begged before the cake company agreed to sign for the 10 percent of maria maria's deal we also know the gist of Eco Atlantic and many other gist that if you push me, we will not roll. Okay, we will roll, sorry. Stop trying to be who you are not and guess who liked it? Tega. So when I saw this and I saw that her tweet in my head, I'm like, okay, basically Tega is coming for Queen. You can't tell me nothing. Like right now, I'm actually waiting for the reunion. Like let reunion come. Let them say what they want to say. You know, Tega has been giving cryptic messages and all that. People of God, let her say what she wants to say. Let her use the art button for crying out loud. Like, I'm tired of half and gist. If you want to drag somebody, drag somebody with your full chest. It's not me who are going to be giving homework this, this new year. Lie here. If you feel you do not have, you know, the, the guts to tag the person with your full chest, we are free to assume it is whoever we feel it is. Simple and short. And have you noticed it, guys? Maybe it's just me. But I just feel like, Tega is giving me lucy's vibe at the reunion 
and I don't mean the fight thing. I feel like even from the house, she was giving me Lucy's vibe. I remember I said it when I saw her. I'm like, ah, this one would be like Auntie Gwe, Gwe, Gwe. I know I said it, but then later on, she kind of changed. But right now, I feel like she's giving me that Lucy. Do you guys remember Lucy in the in the reunion where she was like, she's not up, she's not down. She was like anywhere belly face. Like she just wanted people to patronize her business. So she wasn't trying to make any trouble with anybody. Yeah, I think this is what Tega is doing. Like basically facing who is I don't know. Um what the, what is that stuff they say? Um he that pays the piper detests the tune. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking here. Anyways, guys, away from all that, Queen was also on a roll, but this time around she was going at a blogger or a troll page. <laughs> yes, guys, so this page is a lot of you if you're on this BBN street, you know this page. It's been trolling people. And this year, I think they are supporting Maria. I don't know if they are supporting any other person. But I know they are supporting Maria Sha. And this page doesn't cease, like... This person, this page actually chose Lico Rose, Angel... In fact, let's just say it, this person chose anybody that Maria probably has issues or perceived issues with. And Queen actually joined the list. So apparently, um, because of this call-out that Queen did... Or the drag that Queen put out, this page went on a rampage, insulting Queen, saying all sorts about Queen. Well, Queen was no longer having it as she went on her Instagram story to call out this page. I'm going to read some of the things she put out. She said, the actual icon, deal with this. I see all your useless write-ups about me. I've been ignoring you all, but today I won't. I signed my first deal. You all called me cake ambassador. I ignored yeah, I'm so proud because that brand paid me better. Don't make me start talking, dear blog. Respect yourself and face um and face our career and take my name out of your mouth. Yes, guys, that's what Queen put out. What do I think about this thing? I feel like this is a wrong move on Queen's part because if I am part of her management, I will actually, you know, stop her from putting this out. One thing that gives trolls life, one thing that gives this kind of people life is when you respond instead of responding with your words why don't you just you know um i don't know ignore the person or just respond with your actions like you know do something flaunt something anything i mean that will even send that person into a frenzy because the person doesn't like you so i really don't think she should have let me know what you think in the comment section. But it looks like today is actually between celebrities and blogs, though. Because, I mean, just as we were, you know, trying to digest this whole queen and, you know, uh, Maria and this blog's issue, Nina called out another blogger. Yes, guys, this time around, she called out Tunde Edna. Now, what happened? So, earlier this morning, there was a video that went viral of Nina playing the Zazu song, yeah, Zazu Zen, yeah, that song. And um, she actually said she doesn't understand, you know, why people are all hyped up about the song. That she doesn't really like the song that much. And she feels like the song has been overhyped. Well, a lot of people came at her and all that. First of all, what I like to say is this. I don't understand why we just feel like everybody must like a particular thing. And I'm not saying it's because it's Nina. Like, you guys should understand. If somebody doesn't like... I mean, this whole thing cuts across. Both entertainment scene, both wherever. You people do this a lot. Like, if somebody doesn't like something, that doesn't make them a hater. It doesn't mean that um, whatever. No, the person doesn't like it. We are all different. What I like is different from what you like. So, cut the girl some uh, be slack, I mean, whatever it is it's called. Well, I don't know what happened between she and Tudne and not. I've gone to his page to check, okay, what did he actually put out? Maybe I didn't see it. Maybe he deleted it. I don't know. But Nina wasn't having it, and she put this out and said, someone should tell Tunde and not or whatever his name is to avoid me, because normally you don't F with me, so don't put me on your page, little man. Wow. Little man. Okay. Is Tunde not the little man? Okay, I know he's short, but little man, well, I know that normally, normally, like, Nina has a bad mouth. Do you remember when she called somebody in the house something about goats? Like, uh, oh, I think it was Cece. I don't know if you guys remember that fight. She and Cece were having, like, this epic argument. And she was like, talking to you is like giving a goat a scholarship. I can never, ever forget that. Anyways, guys, that's what Nina said. Like I said, oh, okay, 
maybe she's angry because you know Tunde Eno posted the story of you know she you know complaining about the Zazu song on his page. But then again, Tunde Eno is a blogger, so he has every right to. Abi, Abi. Anyways, guys, I leave that to you. Do you guys think? I mean, this whole energy that celebrities are bringing, where I mean, whatever you do to them, they are no longer ready to ignore. They will just give it to you, but most. What do you guys think about it? Let me know in the comment section. And on that note, I say thank you guys so very much for being part of my channel. If you've not already subscribed, kindly click on the subscription button. Click on the notification bell to let you know whenever I post any new video. Until I come your way again. I remain your darling girl, AZ Nay Williams. Have yourself a beautiful, wonderful day ahead. Bye, guys!